Welcome to training ride number three. Did a little pre-ride. Ah, modifications to the Surly Bridge Club, which I decided to take out today. Probably show you some clips of that. out the uh, MTB Trail Boss mountain bike tires that came stock with a nice pair of Surly extraterrestrials that Mrs. Bikes and Beyond got for Christmas for me and they're outstanding. Um, pump them up to about 40 pounds to start out. We'll see how it works. So far so good. Also changed out of the seat. I had an old seat on here. So far the only changes. I gotta add a little bar tape to the front of the Jones bar yet. Haven't figured out where all the furnishings are gonna go. Thanks for coming along. Got a bit of a headwind here starting out. I'm heading south. It's, it's a bit of a warm day here and it's seasonable for the first weekend in February. Gotta take advantage of it. When I left the house, I was thinking about 30 miles as being my round trip total. We'll see how that goes. 20 for sure, or else what's the point of going out? As many of you probably know, a Surly Bridge Club is made of steel and the Jameis Renegade from Rides 1 and 2, which you can check those out up here. It's a bit heavier, it's made of steel. Jameis Renegade's made of aluminum.
crossed 11 miles into the ride. Hopefully, I'm gonna spin this around. It's probably hard to see on a GoPro, but that is downtown St. Louis, Missouri in the uh, world-renowned Gateway Arch. That'll be on one of the training rides before we go to Iowa, I'm sure. I'm gonna need the distance. But uh, couldn't pick a better day in February for a good bike ride. The sun's out, as you can see. Lots of people out on the trails. Pets, bikes, runners. It was given a good day. Many more ahead. Didn't notice it on my way by the first time. Hit about 13 miles. Turned around, figured I'd do an out and back. But uh, gonna grab a drink and get back on the trail. So I've had my head down pedaling for, it's gonna be four miles here soon. Um, I've been riding up an incline in what would be the bluff from the Mississippi River up to Highway 159 in Illinois. Most of the St. Louis metro areas, when you come from Missouri and Illinois, is a bit of a climb. I didn't anticipate this one being nearly four miles. It's not super steep, you can pedal it, but it's definitely a workout. And uh, I've not been out here for a while, so good, good to get the legs going other parts of me conditioned for this kind of thing. 